Hi guys, my lovely, wonderful people. Thank you so much. Happy Friday, happy weekend in short. I'd like to say thank you so very much for coming again to watch my video. I sincerely appreciate each and every one of you for this massive support. Guys, earlier I talked to you about the Super Eagles coach and uh, the opposition engineer is having to hire have Renard as a Super Eagles coach. This is the newest information concerning the Nigerian attempt to get um, Renard as the Super Eagles coach. But before I do that, I'd like to say thank you so very much for coming. I appreciate the love and the support you guys have been given, and I do not take it for granted. If Paradventure is your first time on this channel, or you have not subscribed at all, you've been coming, please consider subscribing to the channel, press the notification bell so that you don't miss out on my subsequent videos. Also, help to share this video, okay? To my friends out there, I appreciate you greatly. Thank you for your support. My subscribers, the new and the returning one. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate every one of you. All right, now, if you don't mind, please watch this video to the end. Give me a thumbs up and share it as much as you can. If you can, I will appreciate it. All right, now, let's go straight into the gist. The Nigerian Football Federation table official offer to secure a uh, Renard as Super Eagles coach. Super Eagles coach, Nigerian Football Federation made official offer for uh, Renard. You know, the Super Eagles coaching role has been left vacant by former coach Finidi George, just less than two months in charge of the Super Eagles. The Nigerian Football Federation has been linked with a move to Penny D with former head coach of the Aforia national team have Renard and they, according to reports the Frenchman has been offered a 2 million euro per year salary by Nigeria and Egypt football body earlier reports circulating in Nigeria media outlining the Nigerian Football Federation with uh, Renard the former head coach of the Sambia national team the super eagles coaching role has been vacant since uh, former higher star Benedict george resigned from his role after less than two months in charge of the team there have been previous deniers of this and despite this recent reports indicate that uh, the nigerian football federation as uh, as now actively is now actively pursuing you know uh, Reynard, who previously managed South Arabia in their bid to secure a 2026 World Cup ticket. All right, this new development come after financial concern. In the midst of financial concern voiced by Nigerian football fans regarding the potential higher. And uh, as a matter of fact, the BBC sport journalist in person of Uluwashina, Okeleji, had earlier debunked the report, citing a top Nigerian football federation official who confirmed that there had been no discussion with Rena to replace uh, Finidi George. However, the latest information coming to us, reliable information coming to us, has suggested that uh, the Nigerian Football Federation has now made contact with Rena, signaling a potential shift from home-based coach to employing a foreign-based coach, despite budgetary concern. Well, that's left to be decided. Big issue to be to be talked about about uh, you know nigerian buoyance 
in being able to you know finance the foreign coach all right are they capable and they stable financially to be able to hire Renard her as the super eagles coach well i know for years now nigerian football federation have been struggling seriously you know to pay coaches even the the, the, the local coaches not to talk of the the foreign coaches i hope it will not continue like that but if they know they are capable, why not? And if it will do uh, the Super Eagles a lot of good, why not go for him and then get us on on good uh, on front foot as regards qualifying for the Olympics coming up? I mean, for the 2026 World Cup. All right, we need to get that ticket. Nigeria must be at the World Cup. Or what do you think, friends? That's my desire. That is what I think. You know, a big country like this shouldn't be missing out on the biggest football event in the globe. Nigeria must be well represented. Or if you have any uh, any comment that is not in favor of what i've said let me know yes you are free to hear your view in the comment section in as much as you are polite in your words thank you very very much if you are here to subscribe to the channel and it's your new time here you are new here please consider to subscribe to my channel i will appreciate it greatly all right should nigerian football federation pursue this to the end are they capable financially to finance the project? Let me know. If they are, why not? And if it's good, practically, and can make Nigerian football better, why not? All right. That's all about I've come to share with you. At the moment, I'd like to say thank you so very much. One more time, if you have not subscribed, do that now. Now, 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 now. Thank you very much for Please honor me and then subscribe to this channel. Until I come your way next time with another video, I'd like to say to you guys, bye-bye.